<laughs> yeah. So today, ladies and gentlemen, as y'all can see, I'm a convict that just got out of jail, man. More importantly, okay, I miss the prison cuisine, all right? Now that I've been out, I realized, bro, they don't make it like they used to back in the crib. So I took the liberty to figure out a lot of different ingredients and a lot of different recipes we can make to give me that back home taste and that back home feel of being in jail. So I will be only eating jail food for 24 hours. Let's see how this go. Alexa, play Sniper Jones, seven days. <laughs> hmm, I don't have an answer for that. All right, man, one of the first things I've seen on the internet was a prison grilled cheese. Now, I've never had a prison grilled cheese before. I've seen this done on like movies and shit, but I never actually did one. The ingredients is actually very, very simple. All you need is some bread, some aluminum foil, and an iron, bro. So, we about to make prison grilled cheese. For y'all niggas that don't be eating the back of the bread, y'all niggas weird, bro. <laughs> that shit tastes the exact same. Just a little bit drier, a lot drier. All right, bro, so we get two pieces of bread, you know what I'm saying? Bow, bow. All right, I got some sharp cheddar cheese and some butter. That's all we need, bro, that's all we need. All right, so with the butter, I think you're just supposed to chop this up, you know what I'm saying? This reminds me when I was back in the hood. All right, I think, I think they said like you kind of like, kind of spray the butter on here. Obviously, you know what I'm saying, you get the cheese, you throw that here. Now, I say you're supposed to just like fold it like this, grab the iron, and go to work, bro. So let's, let's see if this is legit or not, bro. Jeremy, one out of 10. How good do you think this jailhouse grilled cheese is gonna be? Bro? Wow, should I just leave it on there like this? Like yeah, that, I think that's exactly right. Right, okay, cool, 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 cool. I'm, I'm gonna just leave it like this, you know what I'm saying? By the way, hey, look, I can't cook food regardless. So, prison food, regular food, I'm the same nigga, bro. I'm lost. Like, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. I'm not gonna lie to you. What this shit come out? And it's good as hell. It is. All right, y'all, might be time to flip it, you know what I'm saying? Go ahead. Ah, oh, god damn. It's a little hot, bro. Okay, okay, this shit working. I didn't know if this shit was working or not, but it's definitely hot as hell on the other side, so it's working, Jeremy. I think you might be right, bro. All right, I hear the cheese melt, Jeremy. I think it's done, bro. I think it's done. It's been on there for a minute. Let's unveil. Let's unveil. Let's see what's up. Damn! Get that shit! This might be a W sandwich, nigga. Prison grilled cheese, boy. Say it ain't so. You're making me miss them prison days. You didn't tell me you went to prison, Jeremy. All right, all right, try this shit, try this shit. Try this shit, bro, we gonna try it, we gonna try it together. Got crushed through it. Hey, fucking w. 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 w! This shit good, Jeremy. I told you. Niggas in prison eating better than me. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> this is good, bro. Wow, bro. All right, bro, that's breakfast. We're gonna double back and do something a little bit later for lunch. So the grilled cheese actually was not bad, but now next up, we got lunch. Lunch is a little bit different because I'm actually doing something like a jailhouse favorite. This is probably one of the hardest things to make and it's like one of the most popular things to make in jail. It's called a brick. The ingredients we gonna need for this is a pack of noodles, some Doritos, some pickles, and last but not least, am I the only person that keeps hot sauce in the refrigerator? Yes. Comment down below if that's true or not. I don't know. All right, man, so this is everything we need, bro. And judging by the people who told me how to make this, I gotta be extra aggressive. So let's start making the food, Jim. All right, step one, you gotta beat the living crap out of these noodles. You gotta get them real nice, you know what I'm saying, tenderize them. You gotta, you gotta treat them like a celly that owes you money. All right, so after you tenderize the noodles, you actually gotta do the same thing to the Dorito bag, all right? So I'm gonna break these up real nice, you know what I'm saying? Tell me a lot, Jeremy, tell me a lot. Tight shit, you know what I'm saying, nigga? <laughs> cool, cool, cool. So we got this broken down and the noodles broken down. So I believe the next step is to add the noodles to the chips. So I'm gonna pour this inside, mix it around a little bit. This shit looks like it's about to be so nasty. It's gonna be good, bro. Oh my God. What do you I mean, mean by I'm, that, bro, bro? bro? How do you I'm, know it's gonna be good? How do you know that? All right, next thing you need is some pickles. I got some pickles. Obviously, they ain't got chopping blocks in jail type shit, but it's cool, though. You want to hear a corny dad joke? No. All right, cool. Since you're begging for one, I'll tell you. <laughs> What's the deal, pickle? Everything kosher? All right, so we got the pickles chopped up. I'm gonna toss this inside the bag. I'm not gonna use all this, bro, because I don't really give a damn enough about pickles. Mm -hmm. But I think I do need to taste from the people who told me how to make this, all right? The last thing, which is very, very, very important, is hot water. So I gotta boil some hot water. I'm gonna put that on the stove, and then I gotta pour it in the bag. This might be the nastiest shit. I swear, if this turned out to be good, I'm gonna be surprised. I'm gonna put some water in here. We gotta fold this and so it won't so it won't like leak out with the water. And we kinda gotta form it into a brick. We gotta make it a brick. Press it out like this. 
and you kind of make it into a nice little brick like this right here. I survive in prison, nigga. I'm dead ass making prison cuisine at its highest tier. I'm not gonna lie, bro. This is a W brick, bro. Now you gotta let this sit for about 10 minutes and then we gonna come back to it and I'm gonna try this shit, bro. I cannot believe I'm actually about to, bro. This look like, bro. Wait till y'all see what this shit look like, bro. Look nasty, I'm not gonna lie to you. All right, Jamie, I think this shit is done, bro. I'm not gonna lie. It was supposed to swell up and it didn't swell up, so maybe that's a bad thing. So this is, this is the brick and then you gotta cut it up. You try it first, bro. You try first. You, you know I would, but you you know I you know I just ate. You know nah, bro. Nah, so, nah, 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 nah. Come on, know. come on, Jimmy. Try, it, bro. Try, it, try, it, bro. Be honest with me. It's a brick. Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? All right, bro. I'm trying this shit, but I swear to God, this is like the nastiest thing I've ever seen in my life, bro. Oh my God. I can't. Bro. I can't. What the fuck? How the fuck they eat that, bro? I'm not, I'm not eating that. How the fuck you eat that? Oh my God, Jeremy, what the fuck, bro? I knew that shit was gonna be nasty. I caught it. It is what it is. So out of 10, one out of 10. Nigga, that shit was a one, a zero. That's the nasty shit I've ever consumed in my life, bro. Bro, I can eat that, bro. You really spit it, yo. Nigga. Yo, I, bro, I couldn't even make it to the trash can. I'm being honest. It was really that bad. Bro, I'm sorry. Jay. You just ruined a, a perfectly good brick, bro. What they do in prison for that? Now nah, I don't want to know. Yeah, yeah. Nah. Yeah. Yeah. Now Jerry. Yeah. Jerry, yeah. Jerry, yeah. Jerry, yeah. Jerry, Jerry. All right, guys. Last and not least, okay, we are doing the last jailhouse meal. This is the third meal of the day, and I say the best for last because this one, this is not your everyday meal that you're gonna be able to have in prison if you don't have some commissary dollars. All right, so let me walk y'all through. We got the Lunchables, okay? You can get this on your commissary dollars, you know what I'm saying? You need to get the nacho cheese Lunchables. Another bag of Doritos. They said you can get these in certain prisons, you know what I'm saying? Depending on what your commissary is like. But it's like a pepperoni pizza wrap. Yeah, but we just gonna need the meat out of that. Last but not least, we gonna need this because we are making a jailhouse quesadilla. All right, just like everything else, we're gonna pretty much put this we gonna crush the Doritos up. Damn, bro. This is hey, jailhouse niggas are really creative, bro. Imagine like coming up with, you. they, they damn near like got a restaurant with a whole menu that they made by themselves. Cause they made all these menus, bro. All right, bro, so now we are gonna move over here to, you know what I'm saying, if this is my prison cell, this is the kitchen area. Cause you know, this is where the stove at, all right? So this over here where the stove at. We are gonna lay this down like this. We are gonna take the sandwich that they got us, all right? We are gonna open this up. I'm gonna even keep the same cheese, you know what I'm saying? We might even keep the same little cheese on here. You feel me? This is a lot of cheese, bro. I just thought about that. There's like four different types of cheeses, bro. We gotta put a little bit of the nacho cheese on here. And last but not least, we pour a little bit more Doritos over the top of the cheese. And just like we did the grilled cheese sandwich, bro, we're gonna place this over the top like that. And now, one fold over, and we're gonna heat it up, bro. So let, let's pray for the best, Jeremy. Let's hope that this come out come out good as we needed to. Hey, Jeremy, I'm gonna be honest, bro. I don't know how much more prison food I can eat. I'm actually happy this is the last one. My stomach is tweaking already. Even though I thought the grilled cheese was good, after it sat in my stomach, bro, it's kind of like moving a little funny. Not to mention that nasty ass brick that we just ate. So this one gotta be at least decent at best, bro. I'm not gonna lie. All right, Jeremy, I think we good, bro. I think we straight. Um, let me open this up. Let's see what it look like. Damn, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, th I think this might be the best one, y'all. I'm not gonna lie. All right, so I'm gonna try this one first, Jeremy. I'm gonna try this one first. I'm feeling good on this one. Uh, how you think it's gonna taste? I'm gonna give it a seven out of 10, bro. Seven, okay. Seven out of 10, I'm gonna give it a seven out of 10. Good? It's good, bro. It's good. I knew this one had promise to be good, though. You know what I mean? The iron really works. That thing's valid, right? Hey. The Doritos with the nacho cheese? Hey, this is valid. You give it like a seven and a half. I, I gave it a seven and a half. I gave it a seven and a half. I gave it a 7.5. Seven all right, man, that just about concludes the video, bro. Hopefully y'all enjoyed it, bro. Prison food for 24 hours. I will never, ever do that shit again. But I hope y'all enjoyed the video, man. Make sure you leave a like, make sure you subscribe to the channel. 100K on the way, man. Go download and stream seven days, which is out right now. Till next time, man, it's your boy, Snapper Jones. Peace.